Hello everybody, hope you're having a fantastic day. Thank you so much for checking out the video. Today I'm going to be covering the new cryo turrets that you get at level 65 on the scoreboard. And yeah, we're just going to do a quick video on that. I thought they were really cool and uh, we're going to test them out a little bit. So let's get into it. So this is the daring heavy cryo turret that you can to defend your uh, settlement or camp, whatever you want to call it, um, once you reach level 65 on the score. Now I figured I would test it against a My Alert Queen because they're pretty tanky. So I put three of them down and it did more than a little bit of damage. I was actually surprised what three would do. Um, you'd be probably running around a little bit and, you know, she would probably destroy those turrets before three of them would kill her. But, you know, you don't necessarily have My Alert Queens attacking your camp. So I figured, you know, let's put down five or six and see what that does. I think we got, yeah, we put six down here. I think I did. Yeah, we got it. <laughs> Definitely noticeable. Um, probably killer if you want it to run around enough. And again, for just regular mobs attacking your house, like these turrets just destroy them. You won't even know, you know, enemies are attacking your camp. And uh, the max you can have is 10. So I figured, you know, well, let's try that. So here I am, I got 10 of them down. We're gonna lure the My Alert Queen over here and let's see what it does this time. So as you can see, it just absolutely destroys her. Now, I think a couple of them broke while I was doing this. So like, if you could keep her at a distance, it'd probably kill her even quicker. And there's nothing really that's gonna attack your house. If these things can see it, it's just gonna absolutely destroy them. So if you could just maybe put down two or three of them even, cause they do take up a lot of camp budget, um, they'll more than defend your camp. And as you can see with the 10 here, I had no problem, you know, killing her. I only ran around for a little bit. Um, just to show too, some camps can be attacked by Scorch Beast, and these things just absolutely destroy Scorch Beast. Like, this took all of 30 seconds, I think, to kill the Scorch Beast, something like that. And it can't even really do anything. It pretty much just gets frozen in the sky, as you can see. And it even slows down, like, its sonic boom waves, or whatever you want to call it. So it's actually really nice if you ever have Scorch Beast attacking your camp. And, you know, I figured I'd try it against a Behemoth, because what the heck. And absolutely destroyed him as well. Um, probably would have killed him a little bit quicker if I didn't drag him behind here. But I think you guys all, all get the point. They're, they're absolutely awesome. I'm telling you, if you have regular turrets at your camp, probably want to trade them out for these. I feel that they're just awesome. And they're pretty cool with the blue lasers. You know, you don't really... This is like the first time that I've ever saw anything like this. I just thought it was really cool. And I wanted to share this with you guys. Let me know what you think in the comments. And uh, as always, you know, thank you for the continued support on the channel. And have a great day, everybody. Thank you again for watching.